Good evening, hello. teacher. Well, hello. How are you? I'm very well. Okay, great. Hello, Dori and Janari. Welcome. Hello. Okay. Good evening, teacher. Hi. How was your day today? Relax. Relax. All right, great. Mm -hmm. I'm glad to hear that. She will begin here in about one minute. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, guys. Well, hello, Miguel. Welcome, welcome. Thank welcome, you. Welcome. Let me see. Okay, welcome everyone who is here right now. We are going to begin. Let me see. Let me get this attendance going. Okay. Hello, Rolando, welcome. Okay. Well, hello, welcome, Iris, Alvin. Thank Hi, you teacher. for joining. Good evening. All right, welcome, welcome. Good evening. Anything new? Anything that anyone would like to share with the class? Rolando, Alvin, Miguel, Doris, Brenda, Carlos, Janari. Anything interesting that you would like to share with the class? Any Anything in particular? Any new restaurants that you would recommend? <laughs> Anything? No? Let me see. Okay, let me share screen. Okay, here we go. Okay, we will continue with unit one. All right. And can you read the the topic for today, please, um, Doris? Okay, unit one: the distribution channel vocabulary grammar group activities. Tuesday, November fourth. 20, 2020. Mm -hmm. One. Oh. Mm -hmm. One more time. Tuesday, November 4th, 2021. Very good. How do you pronounce the day? Thursday. 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 
All right. Fourth. 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 Mm. Very good. All right. Continue. And okay. Teacher, Mr. Henry, intermediate for class number three. Okay. Intermediate. Intermediate. Okay. Okay, great. Thank you, Doris. Okay, let me see. I have someone in the chat. All right. Let me see. Who was that? Okay, Edwin. Thank you for sending that to the group. Let me see. No problem. I will take that into consideration when we do the group activity, okay? Thank you for notifying me. Appreciate it. I understand if you're working right now. No problem. All right. Um, just stay connected, okay? Just stay connected. Don't worry about it. Okay, let me stop share for just a second. And I'm going to begin with the uh, first attendance, okay? Abigail. Abigail. Okay, not here. Blanca. Present. Okay, thank you. Brenda, Brenda, okay, Carlos, I'm here, present teacher, okay, thank you, Doris, present, okay, thank you, Edwin, okay, you just told me you're working, no problem, let me see, Francisco, Francisco, okay, okay, Iris, thank you for notifying me. Let me see, Freddy's. I'm here, teacher. Okay, great. Nice background, Freddy's. All right, cool. Right. Let me see, Glenda. Glenda, okay. Iris. Okay, she just told me you got back connection. All right. See, Jackie. Jackie. Okay. Jarvin. Jarvin. Okay, thank you. And Jennifer. Jennifer. Okay. Not here. Juan Jose. I'm here. Okay, thank you. Carla, Carla Margarita, okay, not here. Miguel. Present, teacher. Okay, great, awesome. Neftali. Present. Okay, thank you. Rolando. Hello, teacher. Hey, all right, welcome. Teacher. I just driving right now. Okay, no problem. Thank you for notifying me. I will consider that when we do the activity, okay? Thank you, Rolando. Okay, thank you. No problem. Telma. Telma. Okay, not here. Janari. I'm here, teacher. All right, great. Thank you. And Alvin. Present teacher. All right, great. I see you in the forest right now, right? You're in the woods, right? <laughs> Let me see. Okay, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, fifteen. Okay, class. We will. Um, let me see. I have a mechanism somewhere. Okay. Okay, it is. I understand. Let me share screen again. Okay, so today we're still going to continue with unit one. Remember that we will finish the unit on Monday. And we're going to work on maybe two pages and I have some activities that we will also do in groups. Okay, and I'm going to take note right here, who can and who can't do this activity. in it. 
Edwin. Okay. Okay, class. Now, for today, we're going to focus a little bit on page 18. I'm sorry, not page 18. Page um, 13. Page 13 and page, also page 12, right? Go a little bit back. Page 12 and page 13, we did page 11 yesterday. Um, now we're going to go to that page. Okay. Good evening. Hello, welcome, welcome. I'm sorry to be late. Okay, no problem. Thank you for joining. Let's, um, can I have a volunteer that would like to read uh, this part right here? Any volunteers? Which part? Uh, at the beginning, please, Juan Jose. Let me make this a little bit bigger for you. Thank you. It'll be better. There you go. Can you see it? Yes. Yes. Right. Uh, how to use expression of certainly? Look at the example in the box, then complete the exercises below. Perfect. Continue. Use the Use this expression to show how certain or sure you feel about an action or event. Expression of certainly, uh, mm. certain, certainty. Yes, thank you. Appear before the main verb in a sentence, but after the auxiliary verb. The inventor is certainly coming tomorrow. The manager obviously shows the wall shape up approach to distribution. Okay, just one correction. Chose, chose. Uh, chose, okay. Very good, the wholesale. Wholesale, wholesale. Okay, thank you. Okay. Um, continue? Yes, sir, please. Okay, sometimes expression of certainly, Certain. certainty, certainty can be placed at the beginning of the sentences. Surely. The manager will know how to arrange for distribution. Doubtless, the shipment, shipments will arrive on time. Okay, very good. Doubtless, oh. right? Doubtless. Doubtless, okay, very doubtless. Good. All right, very good. Now, here, I'm going to make a little pause right here before you continue, Juan Jose. You're doing a great job in the reading, but I'm going to pause for just a second, right? Here we are using expressions, vocabulary, and at the same time, you are going to analyze the grammatical structure when using such expressions. Remember that they come before the main verb, but after the auxiliary, right? Whatever auxiliary verb there is, like for example right here is, the main verb is coming, right? We're using present continuous, but we are using an expression, certainly, right? We're using an assurance, something that we feel confident will happen. But let's continue with, with, with the reading. Continue, please, um, in close, what was it? Okay, in close, of course, and it all like, likelihood. Yes. In, in com commas, when they occur in the middle of the sentence. Very good. Now, when we use these terms, of course, and in all likelihood, right? What is in all likelihood? What do you think that means, class? <sighs> hmm. Like for example, right here, in all likelihood, right? Ed and Philip are in all likelihood, as you notice, you put a comma at the beginning and at the end, in all likelihood. Of course, I think you know what that means, right? Like for example, claro que si, right? Or, uh, but in all likelihood, what is that? Um. Probability. Yes, in the pro probability, right? It means in all. Eh, en toda probabilidad o con toda probabilidad or lo más probable. is something that is 
que va a pasar, right? That's what that means, in all likelihood, right? So Ed and Philip are, in all likelihood, ready to make their business grow. So they're ready to take off, right? So we use these terms to express. Remember, they are used to express a little bit more positiveness, right? A little bit more in a positive way where you assure the reader or the listener that something will likely happen or the event will most assuredly take place. Continue, please, um, Juan Jose. Okay. Um, um, this expression, um, I don't remember, or the investment? No, the, you can continue. These expressions? Okay. This expression can also be used at the end of a sentence. Uh, part, partnering with a retailer will uh, will help reach many more customers, obviously. Okay, help us. Help us. Okay. Very good, right? Partnering. In other words, when you join with another person in business or in any activity that has to do with economics, will help us reach many customers. Obviously, right? Obvio, right? When we use the word obvio, we use it a lot in Spanish or when we say obviamente, right? Obviously. So we can use some of these expressions at the end. Now, we can also use them at the beginning, right? Like Juan Jose read earlier, when we have Shirley or doubtless, obviously, we can put these at the beginning, right? Obviamente, right? Partnering with a retail, you can also say it that way. Okay, the difference here is in these two. They come in the, in the middle of the sentence. And when we use these two expressions, we divide them with commas, commas, right? So if you're probably wondering, well, teacher, uh, I would like to do a little bit of practice, right? Get, get, get familiarized with this vocabulary and its usage you're going to do an activity here in a minute outside of the book, right? The book has a little small activity, but I have a bigger activity for you, all right? And can you continue, please? Well, I want to say finish right here, part five. Okay, perfect. Quite what? Divide list in two categories. Words that express certainty, certainty and those that express uncertainty. Very good, excellent. So here, we're just looking at your page in your book, right? And for those that are joining, we are on page number 12. And what you're going to do is, you are going to divide these two categories just on your own. I want you to do this without any help. I want to see how much you know about certainty words and uncertainty words. Which ones do you think will go here? If you have your book there, please write. I can tell you this much. Five go here and five go here, right? But they are already here. Ya están hechas. All you have to do is transfer them to the correct block, right? No es que van a poner las cinco aquí, aquí, right? But they are already here. There are 10. You're going to select five with certainty and one with uh, five with uncertainty. Let's see if you can do this on your own. And then if you have any questions, I will gladly answer them. But let's try to do our own analysis. What do we know? What do you know? Let's see if you can uh, remember that after we do this activity, you're going to write some sentences. And like I mentioned earlier, right, with the grammar structure, we're going to do some of our own sentences using the correct grammar structure, así como lo hablamos empezando la clase, right? La gramática, the grammar structure here in relation to the verbs and the auxiliary verbs. But first, let's do the list. When you finish the list, do not send it to me, okay? This is just 
your own activity. You just have it there, and then we are going to do it together in class. So do not send it to me, okay? This is just uh, an activity in class. Remember that you can go online and look at some of these words and figure out what they mean. And then you can decide whether they are uncertainty or certainty. Remember that five go here and five go here, five and five, not four and six, five and five. Let me know when you finish. If anyone finishes, just let me know, okay? I did finish, teacher. Okay, and if I finished. Okay, great. Everyone else, you have about maybe two minutes. Teacher. All right, great, great. Good evening, teachers. Excuse me for, for to be late, but I finished. Okay, great, great. Thank you, Thelma, no problem. Thank you. Okay, let me see. I'm finished. Okay, great. Everyone Please, else? teacher. Okay, great. Great. You have about one minute for the rest of you. 
before we do this activity together. This is, this is we're starting off easy right now, right? We're starting off easy because then we're going to write some sentences. So for those of you that are finished, you can probably start thinking about some sentences using these uh, vocabulary words. Remember the grammar structure that I mentioned earlier, and it's also in your in your book, in page twelve. You can see the grammar structure comes before the main verb, after an auxiliary, or you can use them in between using these two, or at the end, right? Or at the beginning of the sentence, right? Some of them. You can begin and maybe start on that if you like, maybe a few more seconds for the rest of the classmates. Let me see. Because I also have a speaking activity for 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 all of you to do using these expressions. Let me see. Someone's in the chat. Okay. Thank you, Alvin. Okay, class. What you're going to do now is you're going to tell me. Let me clear this. I'm going to mark the ones that are, let me see. Which ones are the ones that are certainty? Can someone give me some certainty here out of the, bo out of the box right here? Teacher, for example, okay. okay, of course, doubtless, okay, doubtless, doubtless, okay, of course, of course, obviously, of course. obviously, naturally. okay, naturally, naturally, okay, naturally, right. So the other five are uncertainty. Can someone pronounce them for me? Possibly. Hmm? Supposedly. Possibly. Okay, very good. Possibly. O obviously. Obviously. No, um, possibly. All right. Obviously. Apparently. Okay. Apparently. 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 Presumably. Presumably. Yes, and probably, right? Very good. Those are the other five, right? These five that I put in red are are the ones that are certainty, and the other five that I didn't mark are uncertainty. Okay? So like están en rojo van aquí primero, right? Certainty. The ones that I put with the red line. All right, very good, very good. Let me see. Now, now that you have distinguished the difference between certainty and uncertainty. Now, are you able to make some sentences? Now, the instructions here say, write a sentence for each certainty. No, right? I'm going to change this. Write a sentence, no. Um, for each of the certainty and and we are intermediate level, okay? This is more for each of the certainty and uncertainty. All right, so how many are you going to do? ¿Cuántas van a hacer en total? Can someone tell me how many total? Five. Ten. Mm -hmm. Ten sentences. How many? Five sentences. The Five sentences. It's going to be a total of ten. Yeah. Five certainty and five uncertainty. Certainty. Okay. okay. Yes. Sentence. 
right? So it's going to be five here and five here, right? Five certainty, and I added this. Esto no está en el libro. This is not in your book. I added... Hello? Someone said something? No? All right. Let me see. Okay, class. Now, you can use some of some of the ones that are up here also, right? If you like to use, of course, I'm sorry, in all likelihood, you can, okay? If you want to add that one, instead of another one here and substitute it, you can. You can add this one and substitute it for another sentence, right? If you have any questions, please ask me. Please, I will ask you this favor. Do not, please do not use the same subject over and over and over, okay? Así no avanzamos. We do not advance in the English language. We use he, 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 I, 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 he, you, 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 no. Give me some, give me some, some good essence. All right. Give me some good structure. Okay. If you notice all these sent, the investor, the managers, the investment man, the Philip, Ed and Philip, right? Shipment, you use diff partnering, you use different vocabulary. I want you to give me different scenarios and avoid, avoid give me a, giving me a sentence like, I certainly, I certainly like pizza. I supposedly, sentences that are like basic English, please avoid those, okay? Give me something related to, to business, economic growth, uh, culture, something, right? Give me, give me some good, some good structures. Okay, thank you. I have a, a sentence with the with the word certainly. Okay. Certainly? Yes. That's right? Okay. That is correct. For example, uh, I say the boss is certainly a professional. <laughs> yeah, okay. Very good. Very good. Excellent. Very good. With the word naturally. I have we can naturally fly. Okay. So now, we we made airplane. Okay. We, uh, repeat it again, please, Thelma. Um, we can naturally fly. But so so we so we make airplane. <laughs> we make airplanes. Airplanes, right? Airplanes. It's airplane. Okay. 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 Very good. Very good. Yeah, that is correct, right? That, those and are... next, and next we have, um, obviously, obviously, he <laughs> didn't realize the consequences of these actions. Very good. Very good. Very good. Yes. Very good. You're giving me a compliment, right? You're giving me compliments of this of the sentence. Very good. Very good. Yeah. I see us. That's the way that's the way to do it. In about answer uncertainty. What do you say? Excuse me? How do you what do you say? Uncertainty? Yes, uncertainty. Uncertainty. Okay. I have a with uncertainty, the sentence, oh, apparently she was wrong. Apparently? She was wrong. Okay. Can you give me more? More in uh, that sentence? 
apparently she was wrong and can you give me a what or or something apparently she was wrong can you give me more in that sentence in in her job okay sure. okay very good very good apparently she was wrong very good yes excellent now what what everyone's going to do very good uh, uh examples Thelma. Uh, Thelma's giving them right here in class and for the rest of you i want you to send me your 10 sentences to me personally okay this is going to be activity number four in class activity number four in your chat teacher yes uh, uh, or... to my whatsapp okay Probably. I have your WhatsApp teacher, excuse me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Elma, are you in the group? Are you in the um, group? Are you in the WhatsApp group for this class, Elma? No, still. No? Okay. No, still. Okay, let me see. Hmm. Can you join, please? And you can join you have a link in your in your email yes i shake it okay in your email you have a link that says uh unirse al grupo de whatsapp and you can see um please join okay okay right now yes please are you i'll give you time it's difficult for me <laughs> still okay <laughs> Let me see. see something here mm -hmm. I can't still excuse me what happened if um Let me let me do something, Thelma, to help you. Okay, what I'm okay. going to try to find it, and I'm going to paste it here in the Zoom, and you're going to click on chat in Zoom, aquí mismo, and you're going to click so you can enter. But um, let me, I have to stop share. Here. Yes, in the, I'm going to put it there for you. Does anyone have it available right now, the link? If you can paste it here, so I'll have to look for it. Does anyone have the link for the WhatsApp group? Eh, disponible ahorita. I'll find it, but let me see. Okay. Oh, somebody already put it. I didn't know put it so yeah. Okay, Neftali, thank you. I did it right behind you, right? <laughs> All right. Okay, there they go right there. You can click on either one on mine or Neftali's, there's the same link. Okay, thank you, Neftali. Okay, in the chat, Thelma, you can go to the bottom of the Zoom. There's a little part that says chat. Can you see it? Abajo de la aplicación, ahí donde le sale share screen, chat, le sale un, un icono de que dice chat. Lo puede apretar ahí. Please press it and go to the link and you can enter the WhatsApp group through there.
did you did you see the the And will you please, did you find it, Thelma? Did you find the button? No? Can you? Teacher. Yes, did you find it, Dori? Uh, yes. I have a question. I uh, I don't understand the yes uh, the sentences. Uh, send you in WhatsApp. Yes, you're supposed to send them to me. Your the ten sentences. You're supposed uh -huh. to send them uh, to me directly to my to my WhatsApp. Okay. Okay, if you want to mm -hmm. take a picture, eh, lo pueden mandar en captura, or you can send it in in writing if you want in in, in your uh, in the phone. But oh. it'd, be, it'd be easier if you write it, or if you already have your your book, you can write five here, and maybe in the back of the page or something. But it will be ten total, ten total. Okay, esta sería actividad número cuatro. This will be activity number four. All right. Telma, hello Telma, how's everything going? I have some problem with technology, teacher. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> okay. Um, let me see. I'll tell you what, Telma. Uh, I'm going to look at my other computer here. And I have your information there. I'm going to send you a message, okay? through WhatsApp on your phone. Okay? Let me see. Let me see, Thelma. Nostaki, where are you? Okay. I'm going to send you a message. Um, right now, I'm going to... Let me see. Seven. Okay, I sent you a message, Thelma. Did you receive it? That's the phone number that I have in the... Okay. Yes? Ah, there you go, okay. Okay. All right, let me send you the link there, okay? Thank you. 
right right teacher okay. i'm going to send it can to i you. send you the sentence yes okay okay there is the the whatsapp group for the class okay i still link ya se lo mandé to your whatsapp okay okay thank you that's the link for the class all right and you send me the information to me okay you send me the sentences to me okay to the group or to to me to me to me Thelma. Okay. all right all right so i received some already let me see okay okay screenshot is a screenshot is fine okay okay francisco yes teacher. okay that's half right it's a la mitad right yes <laughs> all right <laughs> you sent me five right let me see if yes. you have some that are still sending them all right very good i just want to let you know mm -hmm. all right just a reminder all right so i'm receiving some right now let me see it's okay teacher or oh, i need yes, to I, will, I, will, some. I will check them here in a little mm -hmm. bit I, what i would like for you to send them to me then I'm going to call on some of you to give me some of those sentences and see how well you can express yourself using uh, the certainty and uncertainty expressions, okay? Okay. All right, great. Okay, I, in this case, I select uh, some to al azar. What? Yeah, but uh, I, I work in in others okay so you all right so you you said uh you yeah will you attend the party of course right certainly okay remember that sometime has an s francisco oh sometimes right okay all right yes it is true it's true teacher sorry okay no problem um, thank you for no problem okay so let me write this in my notebook uh, Escribir esta actividad. This is activity number four. Ten sentences. Five certainty. And five uncertainty. Remember that I do this, uh, the purpose for doing this activities in class is to see your your progress and at the same time your participation in class All right so uh, to look at, that's why i'm doing uh, that's why i do these activities to see your participation and your progress right are you actually here doing the activities right now, for those of you that told me that are working or driving, I already took your names, so you do not have to worry about it, okay? I believe Edwin and someone else, uh, the other two people. Okay, class, you have a little bit of time left, maybe a few minutes. Let me... I'm going to give you maybe... Two more minutes, two more minutes. Two more minutes to finish the activity. Teacher? Yes? <laughs> Do you understand to me? <laughs> okay. Yes, I can, I can. The sentences. Ah, let me see. My, my... <laughs> All right, let me see. Okay. 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> I can I can read it. I can read it. You you write like I do. I write just like you. Right? If I show you my handwriting, it's similar. Oh, okay. Mi letra. It's the same to me. <laughs> I write fast. Okay. And then you stand to me. <laughs> yes, I, I write fast, right? I guess uh, when you do like higher education or something, you have to write fast, right? And yes, yes. So I remember. I remember studying in the United States with the professors, and there you have to write fast. You have to write notes quickly, right? Yeah, yeah, just like a taquigrafia. Yeah, like, right? <laughs> yes. All right. So, okay. remember that there are 10 sentences, right? There are 10, Telma. Teacher, I already sent it to you. Okay. Let's see, okay, Alvin. All right. Three, four. Wow, you put number, Alvin, you put number five on top, right? All right, great. Yeah, teacher, sorry. <laughs> I was like, hey, where, where's the, where's the fifth one, right? All right, remember, recuerda. It's on son, top. Yes, it's on top, right? It's on top. Recuerda, son diez oraciones, right? Ten sentences total, right? All right, great. This is just a way to get you going, get the motors going, because the activity that is going to be next it's going to be a speaking activity, okay? And it's going to be interactive, right? So we're looking at grammar, we're looking at vocabulary, and we're looking at sentence structure, okay? Las tres, gramática, vocabulario, y, y estructura de oraciones, right? And your own critical thinking analysis, your own expressions. So we can move on to the next phase, which will be speaking right it will be speaking so here but before we do that activity i'm going to call on some of you okay i'm going to call on some of you to give me some of your sentences like telma telma gave me like three or four right earlier right but what about the rest of you i, I want to hear you i want to hear you also so i'm going to stop share for just a minute and so we will not pause again. I'm going to do the, let me see. Let me look at my other computer over here. Okay, I'm going to do the second attendance, right? Voy a hacer la segunda asistencia. So please, if you're here, say present. Okay. Abigail, Abigail, okay, not here. present. Okay, thank you. Blanca, present. Okay, thank you. Brenda, okay. Carlos, I'm here, present teacher. Okay, thank you. Doris, present. Great. Edwin. Okay, you told me you were working, no problem. Francisco. Present teacher. All right, great. Freddy's. Here, teacher. All right, great. Glenda. Glenda. Okay. No answer. Iris. Present teacher. Thank you. Jackie. Present. Okay, great. Jarvin. Okay. All right. Jennifer. Present. All right. Teacher. Thank you. Juan Jose. Present. Thank you. Carla. Margarita. Present. Ah, hello, Carla. Hi. Hi, welcome. Welcome to the class. 
Thank you. Okay. Miguel. Present teacher. All right. Thank you. Neftali. Present teacher. Okay, great. Roland. Hello. All right. Thank you. Thelma. Present teacher. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. All right. Thank you. And Janari. I'm here. Okay, great. And finally, we have Alvin. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Okay, class, that was the second attendance. And now let's proceed. I will not share screen. I just want to hear you speak. I'm going to call on each one of you individually, all right? So be ready. You're going to give me two sentences. You choose whichever you want. I'm going to begin with Freddy's. Let me get my notebook. Yeah. What the first word? Give me two, please, for the class. Two examples. Okay, number one. So certainly you are being a great help teacher. Okay. Number two, the only honest answer is of course yes <laughs> great great job great job thank you Freddy's excellent okay Thelma do you want to do two more Thelma uh, yes okay. I have one <laughs> okay great uh, salad flavors it's doubtless a matter of taste a matter of taste right it's a matter of taste okay it's a matter it's a matter of taste. Very good, Thelma. Very good. Excellent. Uh, uh, teacher, teacher. Mm -hmm. uh, I have a doubt about, about my sentences. Okay. I use I I use it before doubtless. Okay. In which in which sentence is that? That is number five, right? No, uh number my sentence is Salad flavors, it's doubtless a matter of taste. Is right? Is, is, is. Salad flavor, right? And then you have to use is, is doubtless. Doubtless. Yes. Okay. Very good. Very good. Excellent. All okay. right. Very good, Thelma. Great. Okay. Now, Jackie, let's hear you. Jackie. Okay. Um, an example. Yes. Give us two, please. Ah, two. Okay. Uh, Helen is centrally a very intelligent girl. She will pass the exam. Ah, very good. Very good. And number two, Isaac live near the office. Obviously, he will be early. He will be early, right? All right, very good. Excellent, Jackie. Perfect. Okay, now, um, let me put your name right here, Jackie. Okay, Janari. Okay, teacher. Okay, let's roll. I don't know if it's correct, but you can help me, please. Sure, no problem. Bitcoin is a good investment. Probably I'm going to invert, invest in that crypto. Okay, very good. In that crypto, right? Crypto yeah. is short, or you can say the, the complete word, cryptocurrency, right? Cryptocurrency okay. or crypto. Cryptocurrency. Okay. And maybe other. Okay, <laughs> maybe other, right? This is how yeah. you spell it, right? Currency. The Finance Commission possibly will send correct correspondence from general budget of the nation in mid September. Okay, in mid September. In mid, I'm sorry, teacher, in mid September. Okay, very good, very good. Excellent, Janari. Great, great. All right, very good. Let me put your name right here, Janari. Okay, next. Who hasn't participated? Okay, Alvin, let me hear you. Two examples, please. 
two examples, okay. The child fell down, apparently got a stitch in his mouth. <laughs> in his mouth? <laughs> okay. In his mouth, yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, All right. The consultant presumably came from Asia. From what? Asia. Mm, you mean Asia. 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 All right, very good. Yeah. Very good, excellent. Asia, right? Asia. Asia. Very good, very good. Okay. Perfect. Thank you, Alvin. Neftali. The first sentence. If you search for a reseller in another country, obviously your company will go to the next level. Very good. And the second is the container is probably going to arrive today. Okay, hopefully, right? The container full of uh, full of goods, right? Full of goods. Right. Neftali, very good. Uh, Miguel. Okay. Um, there is great possibility that I can learn English very well in this module. Very good. Perfect. And another. Uh, some companies in the Black Friday give you a discount when you pay, of course, with a credit card. Okay, of course. Of, of course. Very good. Very good. Okay. Excellent. Okay. Good job. Thank you. Okay, Juan Jose, let's hear you, Juan. Okay. I'm going to, to read. Um, the shoes are beautiful and super. Obviously, I buy it. Okay, <laughs> okay, great, yeah. Right. Um, um, I, I'm not sure in, in that sentence. There are many clouds. Apparently, it will rain. Apparently, it will rain. It, it will, okay. It will, it rain. will rain. Okay. Very good, okay. perfect, very good. Okay, um, Carlos. Okay, one, two, three. Uh, um, uh, sorry, I don't listen. Did you say Carla or Carlos? Uh, Carlos, but go ahead, Carla. Let me stay. Carlos, right? No, go ahead, Carla. Carla, go ahead. There's a Carlos, and, oh. but go ahead, Carla. Now that you have the microphone on, let's hear you. Oh. Please participate. Okay. Huh? okay. Uh, the first example, it will be my cat is me wake me up for food early morning. The another example, surely my boss will have a meeting with me tomorrow. Okay. Uh, a meeting tomorrow, right? Okay, great. Thank you, Carla. All right, let me see. Okay. All right, great, awesome. Great job. Carlos. Thank you. No problem. Carlos, one, two, three. Okay, Rolando. Okay, the number one. The last Friday is in November is Black Friday. It's obviously we found many offers. It's correct. Okay, can you repeat it please? I, I think there's... Puedo escuchar algo ahí en el background. I don't know if you're... Uh, can you hear me? It's a lot of uh, noise. Let me... Uh, okay. Let me, let me think. Wait. I don't know if it's... <laughs> ya está regallado ahí, Rolando. <laughs> I'm sorry, but, yeah. but my family don't attend yeah. my instructions. Yeah, like, yeah. I, I <laughs> Please <laughs> shut up and, and be, huh? Yeah, oh. yeah, right? <laughs> yeah. Shut up. I'm trying to give my example, right? Shut up. <laughs> yeah. oh. Oh. What do you say? What do you say? <laughs> yeah. Right? So you, you have okay. to tell your, your family. I can I, this I is can't. a commercial. Oh, this okay. is a commercial. Okay. <laughs> All right. so, okay. Okay. I try to. I try to read it right now. 
the number one, the last Friday in November is Black Friday. It's obviously found many offers. It's obviously found many offers. Found? Uh -huh, yeah. Okay, you obviously find, find. Find, yes. find. Encuentras, right? Fine. Okay, thanks. Okay, very good. And the number two, Carlos, the package is certainly be here tomorrow. Get ready. Okay, be ready, all right? We will all be ready. <laughs> yeah. All right, great, great. Good job, Rolando. Excellent. Thank you. And, and sorry, and sorry. Yeah. Sorry for the commercial. <laughs> no problem, right? Sometimes you get you have family there and they, they make a lot of noise, right? Or they, yeah, just, yeah. they don't realize that they're interfering. But thank you, Rolando. Great. You're Great. welcome. All right. Let's see. Um Blanca. Yes. Okay, let's hear you, Blanca. Okay. I'm going to share the sentence that I give you. Well, I, I only have the, the, the certain sentence, so I'm going to read it. Mm, of course, we have to do all the homework before moms get home. Before, before mom gets home or? Moms, moms get home. Mm, are you referring in plural? No, mom is, uh, I use an, uh, I don't know how to say it in English, apostrophe. Okay. When, it get home. Mm, when mom gets home. There's no need for Ah, mom gets home. Exactly. Ah, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Okay, I, I write it wrong, so. And if you study study a lot for the exam, you're going to get the highest score, doubtless. Okay, all right. Very good, very good, excellent. Good job. Okay. All right, let me see, um, Jarvin. Diet and exercise are obvious more than of life. The wrong one is my homework is presumably correct. I do the best. Okay. I did the best. I did the best. Did the best. Very good. Very good, Jarman. All right, great. Abigail? Yes, teacher. Okay. Um, Bitcoin supposedly will going to rise the price by the end of the year. Yeah. Okay. If you practice every day, of course, you can improve your English skill. Skills. 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 Very good. Excellent. Good job, Abigail. Very good. It is. Okay, teacher. My example number one is um, my boss obviously going to raise my salary. I'm good worker. Okay. And the next, um, my partner is supposedly work working in a range for distribution. All right, for distribution. Very good, it is Excellent, excellent. Jennifer, thank you, it is Jennifer. Teacher, today I connect later to the class, so I didn't get it yet. Okay, no problem. All right, let me see. Anyone else that I missed? Anyone else that I missed? Me? All right. Let me see. Okay, can you give us your two, please? And Francisco, right? Can you give us your two? Doris? Yes. Okay. okay. Uh, the driver's bus probably is guilty for accident. Okay, can you repeat it again, please? The driver's bus probably 
is guilty for accident this okay. morning. Uh, I, 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 the words probably uh, I was wrong in the WhatsApp. Okay. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, remember the. It's, it's, it's P and gray uh, B. <laughs> <laughs> okay. The bus drivers. Bus ah, okay. Yes, the bus driver. Okay, the bus drivers, right? Now, can you repeat the second one? Uh, apparently, my dog broke the dishes. Okay, my apparently my dog broke. Broke. Okay. Apparently, my dog broke the dishes. Very good, excellent, good job, much better. Very good, Doris. Francisco? Yes, teacher. I tried. Go ahead. Uh, certainly. Certainly. Hey, my friend, I tell you, sometimes I do not what way to follow. Um, I do not. I, yes. I, I do not. I do not what way to follow. Mm. No. I, I don't know what you're saying at the end. I don't. No sé qué camino seguir. Okay. I don't know what path. What path? Path. 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 Like this. Path. Eh, camino no es way. Mm, en el contexto que lo está diciendo, mm, no, way is, is too. It's too common. This is the more, more, more accepted word. The path to take. Okay. okay. Path to take. Change. All right. This is a more proper word. Okay. 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 It's a new word for me. Yes. It's like the path. It's a camino, right? The, that path. Okay. Okay, can you give me the second one? Yes, uh, for of course. Will you attend the party? Of course. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Will you attend the party? Of course, right? Of course. Of course, right? Why not? Uh -huh. right? Very good. Thank yes. you. Thank you, Francisco. Okay, thank you, sir. Okay, class. Okay, thank you. All right. Uh, now, this little practice was to get you started get you to begin to analyze some expressions right to be able to open up to be able to speak to be able to analyze and be able to write and distinguish the vocabulary freddy's can you read please yeah uh, so certainly and uncertainly Certainly is the state of being completely certainty. Certainly is the state of being complete, completely confident or having not thought about something. However, uncertainly uncertainty. Uncertainty is when nothing is ever decided or sure. Okay, very good. Remember, no, no doubt no doubt all right it is not not doubt it's no doubt no doubt okay freddy continue read number one please okay give me a second so mm -hmm. okay do you think there will be a third world war all right do you think there will be a third, third world war? war very good continue Number two. Do you think there will be ever be a woman as a U.S. president? Okay, a woman, woman. Right. Okay, continue. Do you imagine having flying cars in the future? Yeah. <laughs> okay, continue. <laughs> I think there is already one. Okay, continue, please. Number four. Will you climb a step mountain? Okay, 
a steep, steep. Yeah. Um, class, what is steep? ¿Qué quiere decir esta palabra steep? A steep mountain. Como empinado. Yeah, así, like this. It's very, like Mount Everest, right? It's very steep, right? It's not easy to climb. Right? It's not like this. It's more like this, right? Very pointy. Very good. Continue, please, Freddy. Will the plan... Bájale volumen, man. Will the planet recover... Will the planet recover over all the pollution? Okay. Where will you be in <laughs> 2030? 2030, right? Maybe. Maybe. Uh, maybe. Maybe, right? Bonus. All right, 2030, right? Continue, please. We are national soccer team. Win a gold or World Cup. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So these are the questions that I have for you. All right. With the is, Alianza. All right. Remember, we are a national team, right? A, a national soccer team. Nos referimos a uh, equipo nacional, right? All right? A selecta. Exactly. Thank you, Juan Jose. Selecta, right? <laughs> all right. That is the, the correct word in our culture, right? Very good. Thank you. Now, these are the questions that I have here for you. And you're going to use certainty or uncertainty. Are you certain or are you uncertain? I want you to use the vocabulary we just saw, the expressions, the words that you have on your book, the practice that you just did. And I want you to now speak and communicate with your classmates and give your opinions, give your certainty or uncertainty, right? These are the questions. Now, you might say, okay, teacher, uh, maybe two of these I cannot do, or I don't know. Then create. You have the option. Tienen la opción de crear sus propias. If you want to create your own, please feel free, okay? I gave you seven here, but if you want to add or take out some, please, I will not stop you. All right, this is your own uh, critical thinking abilities, your own ideology, certainty, and uncertainty. What do you think about the questions? Uh, <laughs> the last one, right? I heard a lot of people laughing, right? <laughs> Number seven, right? All right, but what do you think? Can it be possible? Is it certain or uncertain? You, you tell your classmates, you dialogue, you communicate, you... You speak with your classmates and decide. I'm going to put you in groups and you're going to do the speaking activity, all right? So you can have fun and enjoy speaking with your classmates. Let me see, any questions about the questions? Or any please teacher. Okay, please ask me. Now, could you please share the question in the chat? Sure, no problem. For, for, for how the, the sure. screenshot all. Oh. No problem. Okay. I will Teacher. certainly do, right? Certainly, right? Teacher, excuse yes. me. Yes. Can you can you tell me an example? For example, for the number one, how do you respond to this question? I certainly, <laughs> right? I can be certain about this, right? I think World War uh. Three. It's inevitable, right? It will happen sooner or later, right? So I think this third world war will come, and just like World War One and World War Two, I think this one will be different. I think it will definitely, it will definitely happen. Yes. A lot of people think okay. about the World War, the third world war. It's it's already Peter, like with a virus. <laughs> it could be, it right? It could be, yes. it could be technological. Biology. Biological. Biology. Biological. Biological. Yeah. 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 The future is uncertainty. Yeah. 
<laughs> All right. If you think nah, it's not gonna happen, <laughs> you can, you can express it that way. Right? But I believe it will. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay, teachers. Thank you. All right. No problem. Teacher, we have to discuss the the questions, or we have to write it. No, it's speaking only. Okay. No writing. You do not have to write nothing. This is just speaking. This is your own analysis your own thoughts all right let me see i think someone already i think someone already shared it for me right thank you all right someone already shared it in the group there are the questions all right so it's already on the group okay class i'm going to put you in groups and it's speaking time. Time to you for you to open your wings. Let's break out rooms. Okay, there's going to be some that probably will not do this activity because you're too busy or something. Let me see. Carlos, are you able to do this activity? Okay, no answer. That means no. Um, Edwin, are you still working? Okay, that means he is. Anyone else that cannot do this activity, please tell me so I can leave you here in the main session. Okay, I guess everyone else can. Let's go to breakout rooms. going to assign this manually. All right. Room number one, Abigail, Alvin, Blanca. Let me see, room number two, Doris, Francisco, and Freddy's. Number three, Juan Jose. Iris, is your connection better, Iris? Iris? Hello, Iris? Okay, no answer. That means I will leave her in the main session. Okay, Miguel and Neftali. Room number four, Jackie. Let me see who else. Carla and Roland. Let me see room number five. Thelma, Jennifer, Janari. All right. And I'm going to put one more here just in case Jarvin. okay class ready one two three please join breakout rooms
Um, uh -huh. But I think that the this this movement don't have power, the 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 big power for promote a uh, uh, a woman as a as a president. As a president. Opinion. <laughs> yeah. Well, I but agree. For, I for me, is that... is um, uncertainty. Uncertainty, exactly. It's not yeah. probably. Yes, yes, it's not probably. But not if probably. you remember, many person uh, don't believe that United States will have a a, a black a black president. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was a big surprise. Only, only, only in the fictions, <laughs> the movies. No, exactly, <laughs> only in the movies. Yeah. <laughs> When I when but I watch a, you know, a, it, all will happen. All <laughs> will happen to the future. Yes, it's, nothing yes, it's is wrapped in a, on but, a rock. <laughs> but but it's uncertainty that a woman will be a president. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, okay. I know I'm teacher. How do you say machista? Mm, right. <laughs> 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 the that word is a latin word right that is mainly used here in in our culture right it's 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 like okay we use that word it becomes mainly they use it a lot is the word the word machista right it's originated here in the in Latin America, okay? Yeah, right. It's, it's it's because I, I I listen in 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 Latin Latin America, yeah. Latin America. All right, yeah. but but in the United States, the palabra machista, it, it, if you hear it, si usted la escucha no lo va a creer, right? Aquí le va, right? Sexist. Sexist. Um, ah, yes. Yeah. Right. Right. Yes, yes, you're right. I, yes. Totally, I, I, totally different uh, root. Totalmente la, la raíz de la palabra is totally different. All right. So yes. here we use the word machista in the United States is called sexist. 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 It applies, teacher, that word uh, applies to both genres. Yes. Mm, okay. That's the difference. I saw the difference. You see it in in the mm -hmm. in the American culture or outside Latin America, saliendo aquí Latino America, go outside the boundaries. Sexes can be a woman or a man. Or a man. Exactly. Mm -hmm. There is no gender. Remember that the language oh, yeah. no tiene género, right? No gender. No gender. Okay. Exactly. Right. But here. Exactly. We use the word machista because it's already embedded in our culture that man, right? Even the language, as the lenguaje, if it's one man with women, ya se dice no, eh, nosotros, right? No nosotras, right? So okay. <laughs> yeah, that's why it goes with the with the language also in the culture, but. It doesn't go with the American culture, right? It's the word is sexist. Sexist. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay. Lisa. Thank you. Thank you, you want to learn today. <laughs> okay. Yes. All right. So, is it, 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 you spell it just like you hear it? Okay. So you write it oh. just like you hear it, right? Sexist. Sexist. Yes. Sexist. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank teacher. You. Thank you. Okay. No problem. And okay. Question Carla. number. Remember Carla. that you, Carla. We didn't heard. hear that. Carla's opinion. Do you have an opinion I, about uh, number two? Just my opinion about number two. the husband the, the wife of the husband the wife of <laughs> 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 the 
I don't know. I don't remember the name, but it's a Clinton too. Yeah, it's Hillary Clinton. You're talking about Hillary and Bill Clinton? Yeah, we are Bill Clinton. Bill Clinton, yeah, that's yeah. right. Yeah, we, we're talking about that she ah postuló. How how can I say that? Uh, she almost won the elections for the United States, but she didn't. Yeah, yeah, she, because she she was a candidate. Was, she was in the contest with with. Oh my God, I I I forgot the name of that man. <laughs> You're talking about that, uh, that's a controversial controversial man. Donald Trump. Donald Trump. Donald Trump. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, Donald Trump. Yeah. Uh, and all the different thoughts that he could be a better work or job unless it's Hillary Clinton. So I don't know. Even the, the Latin community vote for, for Donald. I remember that. Yeah. Uh, what do you think and uh, imagine having flying cars in the future? I, I think wonder... it, will, it will be awesome for everyone. Yeah. Teacher, hello. Yes. Do you think there will be ever there there will ever be a woman as a U.S. president? I believe maybe not this coming election, but probably the following one. Not 2024, but maybe 2028. You think so? Yes. Yeah. I was thinking the opposite. You were thinking 2024? No, there, there will never be a woman as a president. Mm -hmm. Because if you see like that, you, uh, well, in, in my opinion, right? In the, I seen like the US government, they're like more into that women cannot be a, a president or a government. So remember, government. remember that Hillary Clinton almost, yeah. she won more votes. But because mm -hmm. the voting system in the United States is different, mm -hmm. she lost by a small by a small number. But she yeah. was very close. Very close, right? Mm -hmm. So remember that the closer you get, eventually you're going to hit the mark. Just like they said that there would never be a black president, right? You had Obama. Yeah. In 20 years ago, that wouldn't have been possible, right? Or maybe what 50 years ago people would have said oh that would have that would never happen right and well, not, I not, think... not only did it happen once it happened twice because he won re-election right he won two yeah. terms so he was for eight years president so i think it will happen in 2028 <laughs> that would be interesting <laughs> You probably will remember me if it happens, right? Yeah. Yeah, teacher, you can put out even that, right? <laughs> All right. So, in it, this moment, I was very, very old. Uh, let me ask you something. Have we had uh, a female president in, in Central America, Honduras, Nicaragua, El Salvador, Guatemala? I think so. Costa Rica? Where? Mm, I don't remember if it was on. No, it was in Costa Rica. No. 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 In Panama? In, in, Panama. in the 90s, in the 90s. In the 90s? In mm, Costa Rica. Eh, mm. no. Nicaragua. No, oh, yeah, Doris. Nicaragua. ¿Cómo se llamaba ella? Violeta. Violeta Chamorro, right? Violeta Chamorro, sí. Yes. Really? Yes, she was a president. Mm. From Nicaragua oh. during, during the when there was much civil right here in Central yes. America. Yes. 
Right. Oh, I, I think that uh, Nicaragua have a, with the president uh, Daniel Ortega ever, forever. <laughs> forever. <laughs> uh, everything changes, right? So, but yes, Doris is correct, right? Violeta Chamorro in Nicaragua. Ah, interesting. In uh, what, in what in, year? In, in, uh, I think it was 1990, oh, 91 okay. or 90. Mm -hmm. Para los finales de la guerra del Salvador. Yes. Yes. It was, it was 91, 92, right? 91, 92. Wow. Yes. Yes. I re I remember I remember mm -hmm. that that time. I was very young for this. Time. <laughs> But yeah. Yes. Okay. I was very children. I was very young, very, very young. young. Oh, okay. Or I you can say, young. or you can say, I was a child. Oh. Okay. Remember yeah, that. Child. Remember that. Children yeah. is plural. Significa niños, plural. Niños. Yes. yes. It's plural. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. You you can see different people in the street, in in our house or neighborhood. Uh, they send or left your pollution in in other sites or, or whatever sites. Yes, the, the people um, uh, in uh, don't don't help to mm -hmm. to clean the the environment. It's very mm -hmm. difficult. I think that it's very difficult to recover. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Mm -hmm. Uh, and if you don't resist the uh, <laughs> the temper temper temperatures temperature temperature for, uh, temperature it is probably that oh, you like to don't like like are are I think it's probably can't you can't you climb this mountain. <laughs> It's difficult. <laughs> when you uh, when you are an ancient like me. <laughs> What did you say? <laughs> I I said to my partner that about the question if uh. you can climb the high mountain. It's difficult for ancient for me, for my my health. Uh, for your, <laughs> for your health, but you, you might be able to climb it, right? I see people climb. I see young people climb and then uh, stop and be like, ah, ah, ah. and I see people older people climb faster, right? It depends. I yeah, guess. faster. It's very easy yes. for for that people. Yes. Right. I remember the last time I went. Now more but, I, but I feel, I feel younger. <laughs> Stronger, yes. right? Yeah. <laughs> yes, in my, in my, in my mind. Only. Yeah. <laughs> that, 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 that's that's where it matters, right? That's where it matters, right? It matters here, right? Yes, it is. Matters. Yes. Okay. okay. Someday I will try. Someday you will try. <laughs> Because I like, yeah, I, I like that family sport. I went to uh, El Cerro de Conchagua, El Volcán. Yeah. Uh -huh. uh, I climbed it, desde abajo hasta arriba, really? right? Oh, no. Or I thought I thought I was going to die, right? <laughs> I did it. I did it. I did it this year in... Um, 
in Holy Week, in Semana Santa, right? I did it this, yeah. this year, este año, I did it. And it took me an hour, an hour and 30 minutes or something. Ooh. Una media, Very fast. Very fast. Why? Right? Because I cut, I cut through. Me fui por, mm -hmm. por el camino corto, así, right? I cut through, through the woods. Or flying, teacher. No, I, <laughs> I went, I went walking and, and it was, oh, man, it was. It was a, Ooh. it was a great experience, but I couldn't breathe. <laughs> yeah. I couldn't breathe, right? Yes, yes. I couldn't yes. breathe. I was like, oh no, am I? I felt cold. Ya está frío. Me sentía. Yeah. I had to sit down. <laughs> oh, it was wow. I but climbed. It's a good yeah. experience, teacher. Yes, it was great. Experience. Yes. <laughs> I climbed at Cerro Verde, and I climbed. Uh, Chaporrastique Volcano, mm. but it was uh, yeah, from oh, that, that's many from... years ago. <laughs> 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 so, Chaporrastique, I drove, right? I drove and then yeah. came back down, but I, I went in, in car. <laughs> out there. No, it was, it was, it's a long, it's, it's very, yeah, yeah it's, it's a very... long, it's a long walk. Right. Yeah. Yes. Yes. <laughs> but it's a good experience. Yeah, I guess if you if you're going to do it, right? It's like <laughs> one, one time in your I'm life. Tired. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, well. Well. Okay. Yeah. You have about you maybe me? two or three minutes left. Okay. Thank you. Teacher. Okay. Thank you. Right. Okay. to make conscious to the people that it's around us. Yes. Don't you? Don't you yeah. think the same? Yeah, I agree with you. Okay. I think that um, the way we, we eat or the way we consume food of animals also affects the
Okay, welcome back, everyone. Welcome back. Thank I hope you. you had a great conversation with your classmates and continue to practice your English skills and your vocabulary in a communicative manner, right? I hope you enjoy that activity, an interactive activity. And you get to express yourself and give your own opinions in regards to the questions given. Let me see. Okay, class. I'm going to begin the final attendance right before we leave. We're just a few minutes away. And remember that tomorrow we will continue with the, with the following page. And let me see. Which will be page 13, okay? Page 13. Right, page 13 of your manual. And that one will be, this is the page we're going to see tomorrow, which is, let me see. Just to give you a little preview. All right, we're going to focus on this page tomorrow, so be a little prepared. This is going to be an activity that you will do in regards to this question. You are a group of farmers with high end products. What is high end? Give us a couple of high end. High end products. with high end. That means these are products like top of the line, right? A producto de alta calidad, high end. That's what that means. So if you hear this word high end, when we're talking about the economy or business, means mm -hmm. the best. It's like to uh, top 10. Yeah, there you go, the top, right? High end, right? Okay. High end products. And you're going to do this activity tomorrow. Right, this is for tomorrow. Okay, I'm just giving you a little preview. And you're going to decide what channels would this company use if you were the owner, right? It says you are a group of farmers. There's some granjeros, right? You are a group of farmers with high end products, con productos de alta calidad, right? Who want to expand out of the local market. So you want to expand. That means go out, go beyond your boundaries. What would you, what type of channels will you use? Will the customers buy? Hmm. Does it fit your product or the organization? And what would be the profit potential? Now you might say, teacher, I don't know. You don't say mucho sobre esto. Right? I don't know too much about this topic. We can modify it. Okay. So don't think that you're going today and say, oh, teacher va a hacer esta, and I don't know. Tomorrow, we can modify it. A qué me refiero? Se puede modificar. Si usted quiere poner algo diferente, please, you can. But that's going to be for tomorrow, okay? You can use any company that you like, or you can create your own company, or si tiene su propia, you can add it here, all right? And then you're going to give your possible uh, channels of distribution, direct or indirect. Ya lo vimos toda la semana, right? We saw it all week. So you are aware of what I'm talking about. And you're going to, um, I'm going to give you some more questions. Maybe not so much this fits product and brand, fits the organization, right? Obvio que va a quedar con la organización. So I think I'm going to take some of these out and I'm going to add my own. I'm going to give you two or three options for tomorrow. So be ready for this page tomorrow and this page, okay? Page 14, All right? That will be for tomorrow, Friday, and then on Monday, we will finish these last two. But uh, okay. lunes, we will do the last two pages and we will be finished with module, I mean, uh, with unit one, okay? All right, I just wanted to give you a little preview before I do the final attendance. Okay, Abigail. Present. Thank you. Blanca. Present. Thank you. Brenda. Let's see if you're here. Yes. Okay, Carlos. 
Okay, you're here. Um, Doris? Doris? Present, teacher. Thank you. Edwin? Okay. Francisco? Present, teacher. Thank you. Freddy's? I'm here, teacher. Okay, excellent. Glenda? Glenda? Okay, she didn't join today. Okay, zero. Iris? Present, teacher. Thank you. Jackie? Okay. Present. Thank you. Jarvin? Okay, I see you right there, Jarvin. Thank you. Jennifer? Jennifer? Okay. Juan Jose? Teacher, I'm here. I'm here. Okay, thank you, Jennifer. Deje modificar esto. All right. Present, All right. teacher. Okay, thank you, Juan Jose. Carla? I am here. Okay, thank you. Carla, um, I have a question for you. Have you joined the WhatsApp group? In the, Are you in the group? In the WhatsApp group? Uh, yes, I am in a group of WhatsApp, but uh, I, for example, on Monday, I saw some pictures, but I didn't understand. Okay. Okay, if you have any questions, please feel free to contact me, okay? Okay, thank you. Okay, no problem. Um, Miguel. Miguel. I'm here, teacher. Okay, thank you. Neftali. Present, teacher. Thank you. Rolando. Hello. Hey, all right. Thelma. Present, present okay. teacher. Thank you. Janari. I'm here. All right, great. And Alvin. Present teacher. All right, great. Thank you, everyone. Remember that um, please do the activities on the platform. Okay, don't forget about that because on Monday, tengo que entregar las notas. Okay, so please have them ready by Monday by midnight. Uh, that way, uh, administration doesn't contact you if you do not do them. Okay, so let's avoid those, those phone calls. Okay, so I hope you. Have a great night. Take care. And the person that stays today is Brenda. All right. So everyone else, good night. Take care. And I'll see you tomorrow for Friday. All right. Good night, Thank everyone. You. Good night. 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 Good Hello, Brenda, can you hear me?